Hi folks, thanks for joining me once again. Today was one of my short and sweet edict reviews. Have you seen them before? You know the rest. Anyway, like you've just seen, Unreal Desserts by Dispergo. So the Unreal range has actually gone through a number of different versions. There was like the Unreals, there was a lot of fruit flavours, there was some Unreal 2s. There's been all sorts of Unreal things. Some of them have been really genuinely Unreal. Really nice flavours. A lot of the fruits I really, really enjoyed from the whole Unreal range. Go and check out on the Dispergo website. Don't forget this little cheeky discount code, FCV20, so you want to use that as well. Another thing with Dispergo, which is really cool, there's so many cool things with Dispergo. If you buy a flavour and you don't like it, don't vape the whole thing, but if you've just vaped a little bit and you don't like it, you can return it and get a replacement. And also, if your order lands on a five, then you get double the amount you've ordered. Pretty cool. Anyway, so I've got the whole range. I know I've been spoiled by Disperger, but the whole range, all five of the new flavors from the Unreal Desserts range. I'm just going to do the one today because this is the one. When I saw the range, I was like, oh, I really hope they sent me that one. Vanilla cheesecake. Now, historically, I'm terrible with desserts. I don't vape desserts very often. But I always see dessert flavors. And I'm always like, there was one. I'm like, oh, that sounds lovely. Do you do that as well? Is it just me or does everyone do that? I always see the dessert flavors and think, oh, that sounds really, really nice. And a vanilla cheesecake, just for me, it sounds like a really nice kind of flavor. I'd really enjoy it. I'd really, really want to vape that one. So, yeah, I've got that juice in an Asgard mini on top of the lost vape. <laughs> oh, I've forgotten. I'm going to look at it. Felima. Felima Crest, 100 watts, 0.15. Let's give it a bash. instantly got that creamy smoothness and the nice subtle sweetness with it as well almost almost what i was kind of hoping it would be and that vanilla -y, that vanilla -y kick which i find vanilla an interesting one vanilla you don't always pick up definitely getting that with this one okay before i cloud up the room i better try and describe that one a little bit more yes first of all with regards to a cheesecake I'm not getting much of like a biscuity kind of base, a butteriness as such. It is kind of there, but I think I'm so kind of focused on this creamy, smooth, almost milky kind of, yeah, like a vanilla-y milk kind of taste that's really nice and smooth, slightly sweet, just like slightly sweetened. That is what I'm enjoying about this. So I'm kind of forgetting. I'm going to have to, I'm probably going to have to re-drip or just drip a little bit more and just give it a nice. See if, see if this kind of, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, a, a cheesecake has a little biscuity base. It's there, but it's definitely the vanilla cheesecake. No, wait, the creamy side of things. You're getting more than the biscuit. Yeah, it is there, but it's, it is. The, what really makes this an enjoyable flavor is definitely the, smoothness the smooth creamy um almost buttery vanilla really nice and smooth if you're looking for a soft smooth slightly sweet dessert kind of flavor this is really nice not sickly it's a light pudding it's a light dessert definitely worth trying so that was unreal with the lid off not right the lid not on right blah, 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 blah. vanilla cheesecake by dispergo so that's all folks was hit the like button or subscribe if you fancy it don't forget to join me on fridays at 9 p.m on flat Coast friday's live stream Massive thanks to the Spurgo for sending this over for review. I'm Flacco Vapor. Thanks for watching.